the poesy of skalds section fifty three how are the uninvolved terms of poesy made by calling each thing by its proper name what are the simple terms for poesy it is called poetry glorifying song laud and praise bragi the old sang this when he was travelling through a forest late at evening a troll woman hailed him in verse asking who passed trolls do call me moon's blank of the giant storm sun's bale fellow in misery of the sibyl warder of the circled ring earth wheel devourer of the heaven what is the troll but that he answered thus skalds do call me vidor's shaped smith gauter's gift finder bard not faulty eager's ale bearer song's arrayer skilled smith of verse what is the skald but this and as Kormakr sang i make more glorifying by far o'er hakon's great son i pay him the song atonement of the gods in his wain thor sitteth and as tordur kolbeinson sang the shield maple let many swift ships and merchant craft and speedy war boats o'er the sea pour the skald's ready song of laud waxed laud as ulfr ugason sang now the stream to the sea cometh but first the laud i sang forth of the messenger of sword rain thus i raised the praise of warriors here poesy is called praise also section fifty four how are the gods named they are called fetters as i Yulfur the valiant skald sang Eirikr draws the lands beneath him at the pleasure of the fetters and fashions the spear battle and bonds as till dolfer of finn sang the skilful god deceiver to the bonds proved a stern sharer of bones the helmet hooded saw somewhat hindered seething powers as einar tinkling scale sang i say the mighty powers magnify hakon's empire julnar as i vinder sang we have fashioned the feast of julnar the prince's praise song strong as a stone bridge deities as kormakr sang the giver of lands who bindeth the sail to the top with gold lace honors him who pours deities verse mead odin wrought charms on rinder section fifty five these names of the heavens are recorded but we have not found all these terms in poems and these skaldic terms even as others are not meet for use in skaldic writing methinks unless one first finds such names in the works of chief skalds heaven hlionir heidtornir storm mimir long lying light fairer driving topmost sky wide fathom vet mimir lightning destroyer wide blue the solar planet is called sun glory everglow all bright sight fair wheel healing ray dvalin's playmate elfin beam doubtful beam luminary the lunar planet is called moon waxer waner year teller mock sun fengari glamour haster crescent glare section fifty six which are the simple terms for earth she is called earth as tildofer sang the hardy point rain's urger oft caused the harsh sword shower ere under him the broad earth with battle he subjected field as otar sang the prince guards the field few kings are so mighty o lifer fattens the eagle foremost is the swede's king ground as hallvardr sang the broad ground neath the venom cold adder bound lies subject to the warrior of the island fetters heaped gold the hone land's lord the hoard dispenseth howder as einar sang brave heroes are defending the hard howder of famous princes with the sword oft splits the helmet before the furious edge storm land as tordur kolbeinson sang the land after the battle was laid low from vaiga northward to agdir south or farther hard is song in conflict fief as otar sang thou fierce war-staff maintainest the fief 
despite two monarchs with heroes kin where the ravens starved not keen-hearted art thou hludin as Wollstein sang i remember how murky earth yawned with graven mouth for the sender of the gold words of the giant of the hard bones of green hludin country as ulfr ugason sang but the flashing-eyed stiff edge rope of the earth stared past the gunwale at the rowan tree of the country of stone the giant tester fjorgin as is said here i was faithful to the free payer of the stream bed of fjorgin's serpent may honour be closely guarded by the giver of the giant stream gold section fifty seven it is correct to paraphrase blood or carrion in terms of the beast which is called strangler by calling them his meat and drink it is not correct to express them in terms of other beasts the strangler is also called wolf as tildolfer sang enough guesting to the ravener was given when the son of sigurdr came from the north the wolf to lure from the wood to the wound here he is called ravener also greedy one as egil sang the greedy one gashed grisly wounds when plashed the red point creek on the raven's beak witch beast as einar sang the guta cold with venom with hot wound gush was reddened the witch beast's warm drink mingled with the water in the sea poured she-wolf as arnor sang the she-wolf's evil kindred swallowed the corpse harm swollen when the green sea was turned to red with gore commingled strangler as ilugi sang there was happiness for the strangler when my lord pursued hosts full many with the sword the necklet miniature pierced the swart snake of the forest thus sang holler he sated the heath beast's hunger the hoar howler in wounds gladdened the king reddened the wild one's mouth hairs the wolf went to drink of the wound and again as tordor sang in blood gelp stud horse waited the dusty pack got fullness of the greedy one's wheat the howler enjoyed the ravener's gore drink the bear is called wide stepper cub winterling orse gibcat tusker youngling roarer yulfudur wilful sharp she-bear horse chaser scratcher hungry one blomir bustler the heart is called modrudnir dalar dalar dain dvalin dunir durathror these are the names of horses enumerated in the rhymes of torgrimmer hrafin and sleipnir the famous horses valar and letfeti tjaldari was there too goldtoper and goti i heard soti told of moor and lunger with mar fig and stufer were with skevader blacker could well bear thegen silver topper and senior i heard fakir spoken of gulfaxi and yor with the gods were blodughofi hight a horse that they said beareth the strength eminent atridi gisel and falhofnir glyer and skybrimir mention too was made of gilir these also are recorded in kalsvisa dagger rode drusil and dvalin rode modnir hjelmter hafeti haki rode fakir the slayer of beli rode blodughofi and skevader was ridden by the ruler of hadings vestein rode valar and vifil rode stufer mein tjofer rode moor and morgin on fakir ali rode hrafen they who rode on to the ice but another southward under adils a grey one wandered wounded with the spear bjorn rode blacker and bjar rode kerter atli rode glaumer and adils on slungvir hugni on hulvir and haraldr on fukvir gunnar rode goti and sigudur grani arvakr and alsvidr draw the sun as is written before hrimfaxi or fjorsvartnir draw the night skinfaxi and gladr are the day's horses these names of oxen are in torgrimmr's rhymes 
of all oxen the names have i accurately learned of these rauder and hefir rekin and hir himin hrudr and apli arfur and arfuni these are the names of serpents dragon fafnir mighty monster adder nidhuggr lindworm she adder goin moin grafvitnir grabakr ofnir svafnir hooded one neat cattle cow calf oxen heifer yearling steer bull sheep ram buck ewe lamb weather swine sow she pig boar hog suckling section fifty eight what are the names of the air and of the winds air is called yawning void and middle world bird abode wind abode wind is called storm breeze gale tempest gust blowing thus does one read in alsvinsmal wind tis called among menfolk and waverer with the gods nayer the great powers name it shrieker the giants and shouter elves call it and hell clamorer tis called the wind is also called blast section fifty nine two are those birds which there is no need to paraphrase otherwise than by calling blood and corpses their drink and meat these are the raven and the eagle all other male birds may be paraphrased in metaphors of blood or corpses and then their names are terms of the eagle or the raven as theodophor sang the prince with eagle's barley doth feed the bloody moorfowl the hoard king bears the sickle of odin to the gory swan's crop the satyr of the vulture of the eagle's sea of corpses stakes each shoal to the southward which he wards with the spear-point these are the names of the raven crow hugin munin bold of mood yearly flyer year teller flesh boder thus sang einar tinkling scale with flesh the host convoker filled the feathered ravens the raven when spears were screaming with the she-wolf's prey was sated thus sang einar skulason he who gluts the gull of hatred our precious lord could govern the sword the hurtful raven of hugin's corpse load eateth and as he sang further but the king's heart swelleth his spirit flushed with battle where heroes shrink dark munin drinks blood from out the wounds as viga gloomer sang when stood the shielded maidens of the gory sword strife eager on the isle the bold of mood then received the meat of wound blood as skuli torsteinsen sang not the hindmost in the hundred might hluk of horns have seen me where to the yearly flyer i fed the wounds full grievous the urn is called eagle old one storm shearer inciter sorer wound shearer cock as einar sang with blood the lips he reddened of the black steed of jarnsaxa with steel urn's meat was furnished the eagle slit the wolf's bait as otar sang the urn swills corpse drink the she-wolf is sated the eagle there feedeth oft the wolf his fangs reddens as Theodorfor sang the spoiler of the lady swiftly flew with tumult to meet the high god rulers long hence in old one's plumage and as stands here with skill will i rehearse of the storm shearer my verse and again as skuli sang early and late with sobbing i wake where well is sated the hawk of the cock's blood ocean then the bard heareth good tidings section sixty what are the names of the sea it is called ocean main wintry lee deep way weir salt lake furtherer as arnor sang and as we have written above let men hear how the earl's king hardy of mind the sea sought the overwhelming ruler failed not to resist the main here it is named sea and main also ocean as hornklofi sang when the man scathing meter of the mansion of the rock reefs thrust the forecastle adder and the skiff out on the ocean in the following verse it is called lake as well thus sang einar 
the lake doth bathe the vessel where the sea gainst each side beateth and the bright wind vanes rattle the surf washes the flood steeds here it is called flood also thus sang refer as was said before wintry one's wet cold spay wife wiles the bear of twisted cables oft into egir's wide jaws where the angry billow breaketh deep as halvadr sang the sword shaker bids be pointed the prow of the hardy ship steed westward in the girdle of all lands the watery deep way as here on our course from land we glided on the way to the coast of finland i see from the ship's road eastward the fells with radiance gleaming weir as egil sang i sailed o'er the weir to the west i bear odin's heart sea so it stands with me ocean as einar sang many a day the cold ocean washes the swarthy deck planks neath the gracious prince and snowstorm furrows mona's girdle salt as arnor sang the hardy king the salt ploughed from the east with hull ice laden brown tempest tossed the lessener of surf gold towards sigtun furtherer as bulverker sang thou didst summon from fair norway a levy the next season with din surf ships the furtherer didst shear o'er decks the sea poured here the sea is called din surf also wide one as refer sang to its breast the stay's steed taketh the home of planks beak furrowed and tosses the wide one over the hard side the wood suffers dusky one as njal of the burning sang we sixteen pumped my lady in four oar rooms but the surge waxed the dusky one beat over the hull of the driven sea ship these are other names for the sea such as it is proper to use in paraphrasing ships or gold ron it is said was egir's wife even as is written here to the sky shot up the deep's gleeds with fearful might the sea surged methinks our stems the clouds cut ron's road to the moon soared upward the daughters of egir and ron are nine and their names are recorded before himingleva dufa blodughada hefring udr hrun bilgja drufen kolga einar skulison recorded the names of six of them in this stanza beginning himingleva sternly stirreth and fiercely the seas wailing welling wave as valgarder sang foam rested in the sea's bed swollen with wind the deep played and the welling waves were washing the awful heads of the warships billow as otar the swarthy sang ye shear with shaven rudder billows moisty deep the broad sheet which girls spun on the masthead with the rollers reindeer sported foam fleck as ormer sang the hawk-like heedful lady has every virtue lofen of the foam flecks flame gold faithful as a friend all faults renounceth wave-born as torleiker the fair sang the sea wails and the wave-born bears bright froth o'er the red wood where gapes the ruler's brown ox with mouth gold ornamented shoal as einar sang nor met the forward-minded where the fierce sea on our friends falls i think the shoal be calm not the ship wood of the waters downward the fells of fullness fall on the bear of tackle now forward winterling stirreth the ship on glommy's sea path comber as here the comber fell headlong o'er me the main called me home unto it i accepted not the sea's bidding breaker as otar sang in burst the ship sides thin rushed the breaker downward flush stood the wind bane of the wood men endured wild tempest then wave as bragi sang the giver of the waves coals who cut thor's slender tackle the line of the land of sea mews loved not to fight the wroth sea sound as einar sang i sheared the sound from hrun southbound my hand was gold wound when the giver i found 
fjord as einar sang next i see a serpent carved well on the splendid alehorn let the fjord fire's dispenser learn how for that i pay him wetness as marcus sang i'll not lampoon the chatterer lord of the fearful sword-blade who squanders the sun of wetness ill is he who spoileth verses end of section sixty recording by expatriate in bangor maine